Three minutes is all it takes to add alerts to your YouTube OBS stream. We start on the Streamlabs website, which is linked in the description. Regardless of whether you have an account, click on log in. Then go ahead and log in with YouTube. If you have multiple accounts, choose the correct one. And if you have a new Streamlabs account, you'll have a lot of setup to skip through. So let's skip through everything. So I'd rather explore on my own. I'm gonna skip the download. I'm gonna click connect more later. You probably don't wanna actually skip this one. So type in your PayPal email. Once it asks you to choose the Streamlabs plan, you only need the free plan. But if you do want to upgrade, I have a discount for you. Just click my affiliate link, which is in the description. It will give you $9 off a monthly plan or $10 off a year plan. Anyway, let's go ahead with the free plan. I will agree to the terms of service. And we're finally on the dashboard where we want to be. And on the left side of the dashboard, I'm clicking on alert box. And once again, I have to close this. Now we've got what we want. Next to widget URL, I'm going to click on this link to copy it. And we're gonna head back into OBS underneath sources, press the plus button, click on browser. I'll name mine something like alerts and I'll press okay. And I'm gonna replace this URL with my other URL. I'm gonna leave the default dimensions, scroll down and shut down source when not visible and press okay. I'm gonna press the lock button against my other sources, which aren't my alerts. I'll click back on my alerts and this red box is where they appear. I'm gonna right click transform, center horizontally. So my alerts are perfectly centered. I'm also gonna add them to my camera scene. My camera is not showing because I'm using it for this video, but I'll do the same thing here. And I'll quickly do a test. So I'll head back to Streamlabs. I'll click on test subscriber. We'll switch back to OBS. And you can see the alerts are now working. If you wanna customize your alerts, just click on each relevant tab here and go through all the different settings to customize the way it looks. And if you wanna add the Streamlabs chatbot to your live stream, then watch this video here.